Hi kids! Today we will learn about different types of soil. So let's start! There are three basic types of soil. Sand, silt, and clay. All types of soil are mainly made up of small particles of weathered rocks. That is, very small, broken pieces of rocks. And different types of soil are differentiated by the size of rock particles in them. Now let's learn about sand. It is characterized by largest rock particles that do not stick together and this type of soil, that is, sand, does not hold any water. Sand is fairly coarse and loose, so water is able to drain through it easily. While this is good for drainage, it is not good for growing plants because sandy soil will not hold water or nutrients. Take some sand in a strainer and add water. Water will easily drain through the sand. So sand is not good soil for growing plants because it does not hold water and nutrients that are required for the growth of plants. Now let's see another type of soil which is called silt. Silt has bigger rock particles than those of sand. It holds some water in contrast to sand, which does not hold any water. Silt is a type of soil which is mainly deposited by rivers. Let's learn more about it. A river, when flows down a mountain, brings with it some weathered or broken rock particles from the mountains. When the river reaches lower areas, it deposits those fine particles on the banks of the river and riverbeds. It seems like very fine sand, which is soft to touch. And this deposited sand is called silt. Now, put some silt in a strainer and now pour water on it. Water will drain through the silt slowly as compared to sand. So silt holds some water and water drains through silt slowly than that through sand. Now we will learn about clay. Clay has the smallest rock particles among all types of soil. They stick together very close to each other. It is very silky and smooth to touch and holds good amount of water. That is, if you add water to clay, much of it will stay in the clay. Now, take some clay in a strainer and now again pour water on it. What do we see? Very little amount of water will drain through the soil. And that too, very slowly, because clay holds the water and water drains through it very slowly. Clay does not drain well and does not provide space for plant roots to breathe. So, only clay in the garden is also not a good option as it won't let plants grow properly. Clay soil is used to grow roses, bergamots, compass plant, and partridge pea. Clay can be fired or dried in the sun to make bricks, which are then used in construction of buildings. Clay combined with straw and sand makes cob, and cob is a construction material which is used to make buildings, ovens, and benches. Clay Soil is also used to make walls, floors, countertop ceramic tiles. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and share this video. And if you want to see more fun videos, you can hit that subscribe button. You can also follow us on Facebook and Instagram for more content. Bye bye